We begin this evening with a celebration of life for the teenager killed in a horrific crash in Sunrise. Venkata Krishnamurthy lost control of his vehicle on Tuesday and drove into a lake. I'm Carly Barnett. Thank you for joining us. A 17 year old Good Samaritan jumped in to try to save him, but unfortunately, neither of them survived. CBS 4's Bo Beth Yates joins us live from Sunrise with more on the memorial that was held today. Bo Beth. Well, Carly, sadly, those teens' lives ended right here. And if you look behind me, you can actually see there's now candles, flowers, balloons, just to remember those that lost their lives in this accident. No reason for love, no season for love. It was an emotional day for family and friends of 18-year-old Venkata Sai Christian Murphy, the student at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High, who was recently killed in an accident. He was always the kindest person in the room. He was always the first person at the court, always the first person looking to play basketball. And I'm going to miss that kid. He's walked into every class that we've had together with nothing but a smile. He's brought joy to every single event that we've been to together, whether it be going out to Chipotle after school, getting something to eat with friends. According to police, Sai was driving in an area he was unfamiliar with, lost control of his car, then plunged into this lake near Northwest 12th Street and North Flamingo Road in the residence of Sawgrass Mills community. He was heading to Taco Bell after playing basketball in a tournament at Coral Springs Gymnasium, and they won the championship and he was heading home from that game. He was hungry and he was looking for Taco Bell and the navigation system took him in this area here and this is how the tragedy happened. And to make matters worse, Andres Pizarro, a family friend, says Sai was on the phone with his father when the accident occurred. And now in his absence, family and friends say they will continue to celebrate Sai's life and legacy. College meant a lot for us academically and him leaving, I thought it would be beneficial to have a scholarship in his name and that scholarship was dedicated to excellence in basketball and hopefully those who are in low income communities guys know that means a lot for his family and for him. Now for details about the scholarship, you can find it on GoFundMe. They're calling it Play With Psy, and they say each student will get around $6,000 a year to go to college in honor of Psy, whose number was six. Sending it back to you, Carly. Such a sad story. Bobeth, thank you for that live report.